after your place, I hit his place up because I would hang out with him just to fucking hang out, right? Yep. Did I tell you that we fucked that one? Yes, time? you did. And I was like, you fucking bitch. <laughs> I was so fucking jealous. I was, fucking, I was like, I you're was getting fucking... some dick and I can't. Like, Damn. You're fucking I'm just fucking making crying. pancakes with me. <laughs> did I tell you I, I pissed on the floor? Happy Sunday, bestie. <laughs> Happy motherfucking Sunday. <sighs> what it do? What it do, yo? Um, shit. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, man. All I get, like, I'm, like I said, I'm gonna start my rants. That's this well, you know what? NFL fine by me. So it's not playing your game, I guess. No, well, my game doesn't start until a little bit later. Oh. Well, my team, right? The Chargers go Bolts, even though they suck. But you know, I'm still gonna represent. <laughs> still gonna represent. Um, I, I can't wear my watch. I just I hide it sometimes. Uh, <laughs> I'm, I'm like Jackson Cleveland. Um, you know what? I really like the fucking quarterback at Jack uh, with Jacksonville. What's his face? That I cute little blondie name. guy. Fucking hot. Hottie. <laughs> he's, he's fucking, he's a hottie. I like him. Yeah, I don't know. I'm going to have to look him up. Yeah, I think he's like, what is he? Number, what is it? I don't know. I don't have my glasses on. <laughs> he's like number 16, 18. I don't know. But he's hot. Okay. Yeah. Well, anyways, that's how my morning's going. <laughs> I'm relaxing. I actually um, got everything done for the most part before I logged on so I'm feeling really good <laughs> that's fucking amazing yesterday I um tried to put up oh, yeah okay I'm late to the party I'm putting up my Christmas trees yesterday okay um trees is, as in plural plural the house is so big and I'm such a minimalist so it's kind of like let's just put this open space with a tree so where'd you put them at so when you walk in the house there's a tree you know that big mirror that i have when you just kind of walk in yes okay so i have one right there okay and then i have one um in the living room and that's like my macy's tree that i spent like i don't fucking know by the tv or by the the sliding doors um by the sliding doors kind of like in between Be- where that mi- where that window is before okay. the sliding door yeah got it yeah well okay kim kardashian with your multiple oh, trees yeah you know yeah i just and you know <laughs> two units like we're gonna do this and i w- so the trees are fake obviously and so, uh, qvc sold me on are you a single mom? Oh, dear God. You bought them from QVC. Yeah. Well, they were like <laughs> selling these Macy trees 10 years ago. And oh, I, okay. <laughs> I'm on. I'm watching. Uh, okay. This is truth. This is facts. If I can't find my fucking remote, I don't know if I'm laying on it. I don't know where the fuck it is. Um, I just watch whatever lands on my screen. And it's always QVC. or It, it, it happens to always be QVC. And I think they fucking know. <laughs> That this is this is what this <laughs> old lady does. She just fucking falls asleep to the TV. So let's try to sell her. But that's how I got so many of my Invicta watches. I'm like, what? No way. Yeah, you told me. Yeah. So um, after we get off the call, you're gonna have to educate me on how to fucking change the time since I we we didn't know how to undo it or I don't know what the proper term is. How to change the time? Yeah, and you're gonna feel so shitty like I did when I'm like this is what I did and to our listeners I know how to change a fucking watch the time on a watch but these Invicta watches that both Pomona Bullets and I have we have the same one there's a certain way or a certain technique to I guess unlocking it before you can change the time because quote unquote it's an underwater watch for 100 yes. meters according to the jeweler and that's why it has that certain dial yeah, and you can't just pull it out because if you pull it out, it's gonna fucking break. And that's what he says every time he doesn't want to pull out and just wants to explode. They never <laughs> want to pull out. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Yeah. It. It. I. Yeah. I can't wait. So how did you figure it out? You were just playing with it, or 
what? Yeah. So, yeah. I just, it, I, okay. I got off of work and I just was having a little nightcap. And I said, wait a second. It can't be that complicated. <laughs> but it really is. <laughs> and I, I, I'm, yeah. And I just. I was like, oh, is that easy? Shit. What the fuck? That's okay, I yeah. I texted you and I was like, bestie, I got I got this. your text. I, I got, got your this. text. But then I'm like, um, if I text her back now, I'm getting ready to go to bed. And I'm like, she's going to call me. And I'm like, it's just going to throw off my whole night. So we're just going to have to table this until Sunday. Because <laughs> I'm an old lady and I go to bed early. So there. Uh, me too. Uh, after I text you, I'm like, it was like my little nightcap. Bestie, I figured it out. What I'm snoring, soft dogs. <laughs> That's how I was. I'm like, fuck this shit. She's gonna have to wait. Yeah, <laughs> she's I'll, dying. Yeah, I'll wait. I'm, I'm. I got nothing but time at at this point. <laughs> oh, pun intended. <laughs> You're so funny. You should take your. You should take your show on the road. Girl, the next show, trust Logan. me. Lowe's is having this um talented. Lowe's has talent. <laughs> and I was like, so it's like stand up or what? Well, shit. I mean, it has to be. I mean, uh, maybe I don't play the drums, but I or hey, sing. we can karaoke. We could take this show on the road. Yeah, we're being Vegas, <laughs> biatch. Fucking low That's right. talent. It's five thousand dollars for the grand prize, but you know, I Just think I have the jokes store, yeah. or is it for multiple locations? It's for the whole nation. So all this. Oh, I was just gonna say. Okay. Well, so, fucking sign up, bitch. Well, you have to send a video, and I'm like, oh, what? Oh God, whatever. Do I upload a podcast? <laughs> <laughs> right. There you go. But then I'm like, oh fuck, I can't because if they go back and they hear all the shit I talk, like, <laughs> never mind. Here's your five thousand dollars. By the way, you're fired. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's all your stocks. And your fucking holiday and vacation and your last Mine check. Mine is all that, yeah. Yeah, last check, bitch. Here's 3000 <laughs> Right, and that's before um, Uncle Sam takes his cut. Yeah. yeah, we all know fucking Uncle Sam. So speaking of Uncle Sam, the I want to say the Super Lotto for California, I think it was a Super Lotto, um, last night, two people won. From this, and they purchased their tickets from the same gas station in Encino, California. How crazy is that? No, I uh, okay. Let's dovetail off of that because I heard that that Powerball somebody uh-huh. lied. What they that said they somebody won? Lied. They said they had the winning ticket. They ne- and they never came forward. Okay, so it's still so I'm there like so for somebody to claim. But it, it's kind of like. This is the whole little DNA homicide detective in me. I'm just like, wait a second. So it doesn't even matter if you say, oh, I'm the winner. The system should say somebody bought a winning ticket. No, that's the location. way it's supposed to be. Right? Yeah. So yeah, you can't just say, is. oh, I won. And let right. everybody think that, oh, you won the billion fucking trillion, whatever. No, and- yeah, it's it's the lottery that says, um, tells you if. It- if somebody actually won the billion or the big the big jackpot or whatever. Right. You don't have a name, but you just know the location and the number. Yes. And, and yeah. So I'm like, okay, Yahoo News. Fuck you. I'm like, is this <laughs> <laughs> clickbait? Yeah. You fucking pump fake bitch. Like, fuck this. <laughs> There's a fucking millionaire out there. And then I need their address. <laughs> right. I'm going to send my, my dog and my kids and we're hungry. <laughs> I need another Christmas tree. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, my, my parlor needs another Christmas tree. I, I don't know. Parlor. Your fucking parlor. I love it. Well, <sighs> well, that's a bit of an Islander word, I guess. And yeah. <laughs> I mean, I know on the, on the mainland, sister, they call it the living room. But <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> There you go. It's, uh, yeah. 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 Shit. I don't know. It, well, anyways, just point blank. My house is too motherfucking big and I don't like to clean and I hate everything. So let's just let's just start there. <laughs> you haven't had any power outages due to, I guess, snow or anything like that. Yeah. Right. 
Okay, mm-hmm. good. Not yet, but it it's it's about it it's heading this way. I know it. I know that it happens is. every year. Oh fuck yeah! And oh, last night I just the rain. It it started the flurries where it's I guess that's what they call it where it snows but it doesn't stick and this is all terminology that I'm learning since I moved here. I just like oh it's snowing they're like no it's flurries because it doesn't stick I go, what what do you mean it doesn't stick well when it hits so the it ground melts? it melts oh okay so okay. it's so it's not snowing it's flurries like it's not cold enough for it to actually snow i guess i don't know or stick or, or whatever where's the where's fucking dallas rains when we need them hey exactly <laughs> Just like, what the fuck is going on? Do I need chains? I'm wearing a beanie and everyone thinks I'm crazy. But why? Because you're wearing a beanie? Yeah. But I'm just trying to protect my naps. Like, I, they I, don't wear, they don't wear beanies? N- they do when it's like under 30 degrees. But when it's like 40 or 50. Oh, I would be wearing one if it was 40. Girl, I'm wearing a scarf, a jacket, a beanie. I have an umbrella. Don't. Don't come to Oregon and have an umbrella. They'll shoot you. Um, <laughs> they know, you know that you ain't from here. The only time I use an umbrella is if it's... fuck. I, I use it for the opposite because I'm Islander like you. Um, I use it if I'm out in the sun and I'm walking in the summertime to block the sun from me. That's the only time because I fucking hate using an umbrella when it's rainy. There's no, it serves no purpose because... Just with the wind wet. and everything, yeah. With the wind and everything, the the rain is slapping me in the face. So what's the point of an umbrella I when it's raining? Well, I, to I just try to protect my hair because I take like hours oh. and hours okay. to straighten it, right? And it's like one fucking drop of water, it just kinks I, it all up. Like the whole I thing. I even think about like that. A, I'm just like shit. But I bought this umbrella that's actually fucking. I thought it was cool, but everybody in Oregon thinks if you have an umbrella, you're a fucking loser and you can't just muscle out the weather. Um, but in my case, I'm protecting my naps, okay? I'm, I'm right. truly trying to. So there's this umbrella where when you get into your car and you know how you're trying to like shake your umbrella yeah. and put it in. It's all crazy. So I was, um, thank you, QPC again. If you want to sponsor <laughs> Top Shelf Hijinks, please do because I'm great. I love your products. So I <laughs> bought this umbrella and it's in a uh, reverse. So instead huh. of it coming down and you shake it, you, it goes up. Yeah, it goes up and then all the fucking water just pours out and then you just bring it into your car. No shit. Yeah. It's fucking amazing. I was like, what the fuck? I I need a I I thought about that. Like that was my idea. But somebody actually put it into action. Right? Yeah. I'm gonna have to check that out. That sounds interesting because I can't see how the water drains if it goes up. Well, it goes up, so all the water. So instead uh-huh. of closing it and then you're like shaking the umbrella and just trying right. to wrap it, it goes up and then you just pour it like oh got it okay so you just turn it or whatever yeah and it's so it's like an okay. opposite umbrella right but it was the best 18 dollars i ever spent i fucking love it um but then again Ooh. i swear i have to i have to watch out for like laser fucking beams on my head um <laughs> <clears throat> yeah but yeah yeah <laughs> So, since you shop on QVC all the time in HSN, what's your most prized, I guess, um, purchase, if that's the proper term, I guess, or order? Um, so, I get a lot of Luminous, which, honestly, fuck that. It's not a prize purchase. I have to actually cancel it because it just constantly keeps coming. And it's- What is Luminous? It's some type of fucking airbrush makeup where it's supposed to, you're supposed to look oh. 10 years younger. I don't, I, you know what? I bought that shit and I never fucking used it. And I was just like, fuck you, Luminous. But <laughs> it, it fucking, I, I, 
I'm not even gonna update my fucking card. Um, it expired, and I'm just they're like, hey, canceled. And I'm like, yes, yeah, just let it cancel. Uh, but the main thing with uh, QVC is, um, wow, <laughs> I do a lot of <laughs> I um sheets and 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 pillows, sheets and pillows. Yeah. Okay, and. Oh, fuck. I just do so much stupid shit. Like, this is when you know you're getting fucking old. Because I was like, I, I do need a wig. <laughs> I don't want to you... buy a wig? Yeah. When do you use it? I, I, or... I never have. I, I don't Oh, my know. fucking God, girl. Okay, you need to put that on and send me a fucking I, picture. Because your hair is fucking I, long. I thought I sent you the video. When no. I told Gina that... <laughs> I need to see you in that fucking wig, bitch. So, girl, it's a, a Karen wig. Picture. It's a Karen wig. I swear. <laughs> I just thought to myself, but <laughs> I swear it's a Karen wig. Break if I'm going to go that out. wig afterwards, bitch, and put it on and send me a you. fucking picture. But, you know, I never wore a wig ever in my life, and I have that island hair. So, I was, just I was like, oh, so nice. I need... I need a little hairnet. I need like. Thank you like, very much. There's so That's much why I'm like, you didn't shit. think this out. <laughs> no, I didn't. It was QVC. Thank you, QVC. I still bought it. Like, I just thought I needed it. <laughs> I just thought I needed it. The bitch said, you know, you wake up late. You're trying to get to work. Why don't you just throw this on? It looks so natural. I was like, fuck yeah, I fucking need that. <laughs> I, fucking, I don't know. And I'm just like, yeah, this shit ain't going to work. I'm like Karen all day, but I, I I can't wait to be in the grocery store. Put that bitch on. Be like it wasn't me. I'm shaggy. Like it wasn't me. Fucking Karen. I'm gonna fucking. I'm gonna yell at everybody. Why isn't there a line open? Why do I? I have I I have more than 15 items. Why do I have to be in the self checkout? Fuck this shit. I'm gonna fucking squirt some goddamn fucking something on the floor i'm gonna slip i'm gonna like, <laughs> i'm gonna do all that with this karen wig i swear oh my god i have fucking tears coming down my face i'm gonna sue everybody i'm gonna sue everybody with this wig on with this oh wig my on. fucking god it's fucking insane. I'm gonna, I'm gonna fuck it. I'm gonna put it on when we FaceTime after Please this episode. Do. Please do. <laughs> I'm gonna show Holy you this. Shit. Fix your watch. Well, <laughs> well there was Karen wig. <laughs> there was something I didn't think through yesterday, but not to the extent of um what you just did. <laughs> I'm serious. This is my life, people. I this is welcome to my life, and I'm glad to share it with fuck. everybody in the world. Okay, so here's what happened to me yesterday. Yesterday morning, I get, I wake up, I do my chores, and then I get on Instagram, and I'm like, the Hello Kitty mobile truck's going to be at the West Covina Mall from 10 to 7. <laughs> Sweet. I'm fucking going because I love Hello Kitty. That's yeah. the girl in me. Carry karaoke. Right? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> and I'm bad bats maroon for me. <laughs> and I tell my daughter, I'm like, babe, I'm going to, um, I'm going to go to the mall. Um, do you want to go with me? Um, Hello Kitty, the mobile truck is there. And she looked at me like I'm a fucking idiot. She's like, no. So I'm like, fine, I'm fucking going. Girl, I get there at 10 fucking 45. There is a line wrapped around the abandoned Sears. And I'm like, no. I was in my car. Yes. I was in my fucking car. And I'm like, well, I'm just going to keep on rolling home. <laughs> Bitch, I would have been like, abandoned Sears. I would I, I put, a, put a fucking little name tag or something on your chest and just be like excuse me excuse me excuse me it's like yeah put on some scrubs from walmart you just be like excuse me excuse me somebody needs some help and just cut in line <laughs> i should have did that fucking line wrapped around the sears building and i'm like and i come home and my daughter's like um so how'd it go i'm like the, there was a line wrapped around sears and she's like yeah that's what i thought i'm like well you know i didn't think this through that would have been great if you fucking told me that like there would be a long line mom <laughs> well you know, I just start kicking tents and shit, and I'm just like, excuse me, excuse man, me. pardon me, somebody needs CPR. Like, <laughs> <laughs> and I just stand in line in front of them, like, fuck you. Jesus. And then I abandoned that Sears. Through. That is funny as fuck. I'm sorry, Betsy. All the malls around, well, 
that's fine. I don't care. I don't even think Sears is in business yeah, anymore. I, I don't know. I thought Bed Bath and Beyond went out, but I'm still getting like, "Hello, we're back." And it's like, "What the fuck?" I'm getting these emails. Oh, they're back. Oh, maybe just online. I, I don't. I thought they closed their store. That's too. what I thought, but they're like, "Hello, we're back." We're back, huh. Pomona Bullets. I'm like, oh, you bitch motherfuckers. Like, I swear <laughs> to God, you were my fucking, oh, kryptonite. Please. Yeah. Oh, my God. Those salty tears that came rolling down my face now are stinging my skin. <laughs> <laughs> God damn it, Pomona Bullets. You're so hilarious. Oh, wow. Shit. I'm here all night. <laughs> right? <laughs> Okay, I have a question. Um, do you possess, do you own a lot of hoodies like me? Yeah. Yes, I do. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Do they just hang up in your fucking closet? Or how do you store them? Yeah, I hang them in my closet. And because it's the hood, you know. Right. From the hood. Uh, I have like a certain section where it's just nothing but fucking hoodies. Because that's how I roll. It's, it's- yeah, that's how I am too when I do it. My thing is this, because, you know, when you stick them on the hangers, it has the hanger hook. Or, like, when you take it off the hanger, yeah, it, like, it, it still has the hanger indent. I fucking hate that shit. Oh, so what I do is I put um, the hood inside. Inside, like, kind of, like, inside. Like, well, it, it, I don't know. I, I can't explain it. Jeez, but I put well, the- you can show me on FaceTime later. Okay, so I put the hood inside, like almost like it's a sweater. Okay. And um, I but I do have I can't use those Walmart fucking you know ten hangers for fucking five bucks. Yeah, I, I don't, don't I don't work. do that shit because I don't know how many of those fucking hangers I broke when I'm just trying to like be lazy and pull one of the hoodies off and it's like right breaks. So I have to have a little bit a sturdier hanger but i do put my hood inside because okay sometimes in when it's like the summer mm-hmm. i'm just like what the fuck how did my clothes get dust on it like <laughs> especially yeah just hanging in the closet yeah and i'm just like what the fuck is going on organ or maybe maybe it's not just organ i don't i don't know just... No, that's how it is here too. But um, so I have a recliner in the in my daughter's office since she worked from home, and I have like at least twelve hoodies, and they're all just fucking sitting on the fucking recliner, and I um on the recli- recliner back because I don't like the stupid hanger indents on the shoulders. Yes, mm-hmm. I fucking hung them all up yesterday. I'm like, this is ridiculous. I have a closet. They just I just need to suck it up. And I hung them up, and I'm like, God damn it! <laughs> well, now they're gonna have all hanger indents again. So that's <laughs> my thing is. But that's one of my rants is those goddamn hanger indents. Well, do you have those hangers that have that little, like, if you, like, one of those little nice t-shirts and they have those little fucking silk straps and you put it in that little in there. indention type shit? No. So, like you, I don't do the, I do the plastic hangers, um, those 10 for a dollar or whatever, yeah. but I do that for, like, shirts or whatever. But when it comes to hoodies, I do the velvet. You know what the velvet hangers are? Oh, yes. I have some. Yeah. Yeah. I have velvet hangers, so I put them on that, and I guess it lessens the indent, but it's still there. It's just in a different spot. <laughs> well, I want to tell you that I don't, I I now, I don't put um, certain shirts or hoodies on the hanger, like how you would typically put a hanger on just in, and hang it. Oh, I, I, I actually fold the shit in half. I was just going to say, do you fold it the way like yep. the department stores do? um yeah okay there you are i thought you cut out oh no i i girl i'm gonna show you i can't wait and i wish i could share this to the world because these are like true life hacks (laughs) i have a system and it it works it works it works there's no more fucking Hanger indents. lines and dents and yeah, I hate that. All right, shit. yeah, I, okay, because well, it was ridiculous. I'm like, I need to get this off the recliner because I'm not a messy person. It just looks messy and unorganized when they're all when you got 20 or I don't know. I'm exaggerating when you have 15 stacked on there, not 20. I probably have about 15 hoodies, but they're all just stacked on there. 
and I go through them to figure out which one I'm going to wear for the day. By the way, I am not wearing my Top Shelf Hijinks podcast hoodie today. I'm wearing my TBK hoodie. You know, I'm wearing a fucking Carhartt because it's cold here. So, yeah. Shit. I know. But I uh, did wash our Top Shelf Hijinks hoodie. And did you throw it in the dryer? I don't throw no. mine in the dryer. I was oh, okay. scared. I was like, yeah, same with me because it was, it was, it's a heat transfer. It's not yeah. the actual silk screen. Yeah. I'm fucking, I'm grown. I know. Like, fuck. And plus it's black. So anything that's black, I don't fucking throw in the dryer if I can help it. Yeah. I was just like, you know what? Here's some extra fucking downy and I'm going <laughs> to hang it up. I don't, the way I hang it up. I don't do fabric softener anymore. I got lazy, like maybe. 10 years ago. I guess I need to start back with that. I don't know. You know what I do? I, I fuck fabric softener. I, I mean, I have spray and wash. And but I, that's stain remover, isn't it? Yeah, but I do it for the bottom of socks, I guess. That's uh, pretty just much. Buy, pretty buy much. black socks and that eliminates the well, spray and wash. Well, it's for the kids. And then, and then when I uh, cook, dinner uh-huh. or food or whatever to feed these minions um i don't like getting popped by grease so i'm always putting on a hoodie oh got it okay i'm just like fuck that i mean i i bruise easily i don't know am i anemic right. do i need like iron pills i don't fucking like it just a pop of grease i'm just like oh shit so i wear long the sleeves hoodie. and right and my my poor hoodies. Fuck. I'm like, fuck you, Grease. Canola oil. <laughs> Speaking of bruises, I picked up a pizza before we got we logged on. And I was half asleep. I put it in the back of my um my Kia what the fuck do I have? The Kia Soul. Pomona bullets. I go to pull um to pull down the fucking hatch <laughs> and I'm not paying attention. This thing doesn't pull all the way down, and I fucking walk my pelvis into the goddamn fucking hatch, and I'm just like, well, that's going to bruise. Oh, my God. I was so fucking pissed. I'm like, you know what? I'm so fucking tired today. So I haven't looked, but I'm sure there's going to be a one long line bruise. (laughs) Girl, you're going to fucking wake up tomorrow. Just be like, booze bruise? What the fuck? No, that's what I'm telling you now in case I forget. you're going to forget. I'm not yeah, gonna, you're forget. gonna forget. That's why I'm that. telling you. You feel like I'm like, what happened? What happened to my fucking pelvis or like my where my um my hip is? It hit the hip, and I'm just like, God damn it! Oh, yeah, wow. it hit the bone. Son of a monkey. That's... Whatever. That's what I get for not paying attention. No, that's what we get for being old. <laughs> that too. <laughs> but yeah, I bruise easy too, and it's just like I take my vitamins. I fucking eat pretty much clean for the most part or whatever so why the fuck am i bruising <clears throat> girl i got <laughs> okay so i have bruises on my feet and i'm like How on the, the bottom of your feet no the top and um okay I was... i'm thinking what the fuck like how is this really fucking happening is it my shoes are okay i mean i have dr Scholl's. i don't fucking know um but I started this new uh, little workout. Okay. And, and so basically I just have, a, so it's called like um, a stepper, like a Reebok. Mine in specific is a Reebok stepper. So it's like the step or the platform Yeah, it's just thing? like a step. But I have so many fucking steps in my house and I kind of was like iffy of buying it. So I was like, maybe okay. I can just do this shit because I have all these steps in my house. But and I and I honestly thought maybe I could just well, there's no phone books anymore, so <laughs> right. I was just like, ah. So I get the stepper, and <clears throat> it's called Stepper Stepper Ton. Did you get it on QVC? No, I actually got this one on Amazon. Thank you, Amazon. Thank you, <laughs> Jeff. <laughs> so it's like I still be shopping with you. Um, sending you to the moon. And oh wait. No, anyhow. Yeah, let's just scratch that. So I buy this stupid little stepper thingy. It's 150 bucks. And I'm just like, this is all me. This is what I need okay. to do because I need to keep moving. I need I mean, it's my yoga. I used to do yoga in the morning and just try to tighten shit up and stretch. But 
Like, my favorite pose is the corpse. Is that just laying down on your back? <laughs> <laughs> I see you. I feel you. Girl, I'm just like, wait, wait. It, it does do some type of purpose. <sighs> and I just sound long. It's like, oh, shit. And then my alarm goes off, the little fucking snooze button. And I'm like, yes, I'm getting up. Going to work. But that was the greatest <laughs> yoga fucking event that I've ever fucking did. Um, because I'm just like wobbly. My core isn't that great. I'm just, I, I lie and I tell people I'm fucking happy. Like, it's just it's crazy. Girl, you need to like so, just do some planks for your core. You know how to do planks? Just hold it for like 15 seconds and build your way up for your core. It's and like, then just. Yeah, I, I think I need to work on my core because, like, my calves are on fucking fleek. They pop and shit. And I'm like, yeah, I, I don't have cankles. Like, fuck yeah. I'm just like, boom. I can do flutter oh my kicks God, like a you, bitch. Like, you are hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> it's just this fucking, like, I need my core. So I started doing this. Um, It's called Stepper, Stepper Ton. Stepper okay. Ton. Okay. Now this guy is like crazy. He just he just put on some music and it kind of makes me feel what my grandmother, rest in peace, used to do. She used to do fucking um dancing. What what was his name? That little guy, Richard. Richard Simmons. Yes. <laughs> my grandma used to try to do that shit. Can you imagine a little Filipina just like Mm, 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 mm. I know and you know what I I respect that so I'm like okay grandma rest in peace I'm doing stepper tron and or ton excuse me it's not tron and <laughs> I'm doing these little but shit you just think just going up and down and up and down and these little steps like half a foot I don't How know but steps are there it's only one <laughs> Oh, okay. We said steps, so I thought there was more. <laughs> well, you have to keep going up and down on this little half foot of a step, and then you okay. turn, and then you you they do these little moves. It's kind of like a TikTok type shit. I don't know. I fucking subscribed. Um, yeah, I'm I'm hurting. Like I feel like I got hit by a bus and shit, and I just was going up and down the step. <laughs> Oh, I'm looking at I'm looking at Amazon right now. The stepper ton. Okay, yeah, okay. That's not that's like a box box. Yeah, but yeah, but the guy gives you all these moves, and he says you got to turn and you go down and you go up and you go down, and then you do it to music to make it fun, engaging. I guess. Yeah, I was just gonna say you don't want to do it without music. You'd probably yeah. be bored off your ass. And I'm just like, okay, Justin Timberlake, I'm going to cry me a river, cry me a river. And I'm doing all this shit, but damn. <laughs> Fuck. I fucking hurt. Oh, Jesus Christ, Pomona Bullets. I know. That's why I'm fucking single. Oh, it's okay, God. Now. I know. <laughs> I know. <laughs> fucking, <laughs> thank God. Nobody, no one. I'm too rough around the edges. <laughs> oh, well, you know what? That's a good thing. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Nobody wants that to That means you're this. a diamond. You're precious. I'm a diamond in the rough. <laughs> That's right, bitch. Yeah. I don't give a shit. Give a fuck. <laughs> I'll give a fuck. <laughs> <sighs> that's right hey did you work yesterday or was your day off i can't keep up with yeah you. i fucking worked yesterday is it getting oh more crazy God. is it getting more crazy because it's getting i guess now it's like the month of christmas or is it just normal or what <laughs> for lows i wanted to text you so bad so bad yesterday just like help like sos bestie, <laughs> please i fucking just need to mentally decompose press every press. fucking everything but so <laughs> fuck my life all right so i go to work i know i have to close payroll do all this and this and that blah 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 and then i get uh an employee that comes in gonna be santa it's santa's workshop 
And I, I'm thinking to myself, is this another fucking level of responsibilities that nobody told me that I was supposed to be responsible for? Okay. And I said, okay. And I said, um, he's all, and you're going to be Santa's little helper. And I said, well, oh, okay, God wait, damn it. Back the truck up. <laughs> draw the line here. And I will literally walk off the job. Like, I, I'm not going to be Santa's little helper. It's 38 degrees outside. What is the outfit? No. And where are you supposed to be? Like, what the f- Did he explain what's going on? He's like, I don't know. I got called in. It's my day off. And I go onto his time card. I'm like, holy fuck. I'm like, why did you fucking agree to this? Why? He's like, why? Just, you know, I, I don't know. They called For the me. Whole day. Yeah. And I was like, holy fuck. I'm like, all right, dude. Santa it is. So I'm helping him and I'm putting... I'm trying to help, but he has clothes, uh, like, legit, um, uh, I guess you would say, what, thermals or long johns or, okay. and, and stuff, so it's, and I'm trying to put the Santa suit on, I'm stuffing the fucking belly in there, I'm just like, wow, and he's like, so are you gonna be Santa's little helper? I'm like, fuck no. Like, honestly, <laughs> I didn't get the memo, so, like, I'm not gonna be Fucking, and I was like, where's Santa's little helper's outfit? And I'm like, that's like a Kelly style outfit. And it's like 30 fucking eight degrees. I am not going to. No. That's against dress code. <laughs> so did did he do that to like hang out with the customers or what was he yes, doing? Yes. So it was like a Santa's little workshop type deal. And. Poor guy. Yeah, he was out there, but I made sure there was a bunch of heating lamps and I put some coloring sheets for the kids and I and he was building little like I don't fucking know what the shit was, but he was building stuff and I just oh. felt so bad for him. And he's like, but I need a Santa's little helper. I'm like, no, 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 no. I, I would if it was Kelly style and the weather was good. I would just be like, boom. Right. I, I, I'll bring in customers. Like, yeah. Yeah. Because I'm cute. It's like, I could do it. But fuck no. I'm not doing that. If I can miss me with that shit. I felt bad. So, I'm not ignoring you, Pomona Bullets. I'm on my Twitter feed right now because you know I love Raider Nation. Okay, so... The football scout just tweeted about 25 minutes ago, Derek Carr yelled at his off uh, uh, at his O-line after taking a sack and things got heated between him and the one of and one of his linemen. And my boy, one of Raider Nation replies, "Sissy boy, Derek Carr getting checked. Fire." <laughs> oh my gosh, that's why I don't like <clears throat> Raiders. You guys are so brutal. No, 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 no. Oh, yeah. That's because, you, you know, we're aggressive. Like I know. Anything. You guys throw <laughs> fucking... <laughs> you guys throw bottles at my head. Uh, it was... <laughs> Fuck. And I'm a fucking Charger fan. I'm like, stop. I don't want to fight. <laughs> you should have... Oh, fuck. You won. Why are you trying to... <laughs> why are you trying to fucking slash my tires? Like, <laughs> You guys are crazy. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to choke on my fucking water here, bitch. <laughs> Aquafina for days. I don't even know how we're fucking playing today. We had a bye last week, I believe. I don't know yeah. how we're playing today. And I'm assuming we're playing at one because there's no type of feed whatsoever. Or there's no yeah. tweets on my feed saying that. Oh, we're probably playing at home today. That's probably what we're playing. And here's... Uh... Um, Speaking of our main topic, Chad Ocho Cinco, our boy, him and his wife, or I guess mm. his fiance, she posted a picture of them hanging out in a waterfall. I fucking love those two. He finally met his match. And you know, she um her name is Sherelle Rosado. So she's a high end um real estate or realtor, I guess. You should work for her. You're fu- you're an underwriter. Yeah, girl, I was like, why the fuck did I not know? But that's because that's the the whole fucking downside of not being online <laughs> yeah i never knew i didn't know anything about her but um so they started dating because um her one of her kids ran track with one of his kids and so she saw she, she was seeing 
she kept seeing them. I want to say if I'm saying this right, she kept seeing Ocho Cinco and I, I want to say it was his daughter um, at what at the track meets because her, her kid was running track too. And so they, I guess they started talking or whatever, but she slid into his DMs and then from oh. there, it's, the rest is history. And I'm like, and you know, she used to be in the army and she would jump or she would parachute out of fucking planes. And I'm like, oh, she, he fucking met his match. When I read that, I'm like, oh, she for real. Oh, and then there was a disco ball. <laughs> yes, yes. And I, and you know what? I don't know. You know what? Like, God bless that fucking matrimony. Like, I, I just, I love Ocho Cinco. Did you watch Same. Ultimate Catch? Did I watch Ultimate Catch? Yes. Is that what Ocho Cinco? No, when he was single, so. and it was like a bachelor type deal. Oh no! I no! I never! I didn't even know that was a show. I'm like, what is that? Oh shit, girl! I was so like, like the flavor flame. Oh, okay. Yeah, well, it, yeah. It, yeah. Yeah. He's. I just think he's so fucking handsome, and the fact that he finally met his match and the, the fucking chick that I guess I'm like, if she jumps out of planes, was in the military, and now she has her own real estate firm after mm. the military, and it's maybe I can end. work for her. <laughs> do you have Netflix? I do. She has a show on there. It's like I don't know. I'll I'll find out what it's called, but it's a reality show um for her her real estate firm. Oh, sh- you know what? God bless little Ocho Cinco. He's my little Coco. I I I love his teeth. I love his smile. I love his fucking swag. He is amazing. Mm-hmm. I mm, that boy running on three legs. <laughs> oh yeah. When you sent me that, I'm like I've known that, but that's because you're not on Twitter. Like he yeah, talks about that I'm shit like- all the fucking time. On late Twitter. to the party all the day, all day long, late to the party. I'm actually considering trying to sign, thinking about signing up for a goddamn YouTube um, subscription just so I can not have the fucking commercials because that Shannon Sharp, um, I really like the Shannon Sharp YouTube series that's going on. I don't know if you listen to it, but you know how you sent me that snippet? Yeah. From, Yeah. I swear to God, there is a fucking commercial every 90 seconds yeah. or every two minutes for his fucking show. That doesn't, that never happened for like, that doesn't happen for all the other shows. I, I guess I listen to our podcasts. I listen to on YouTube, but for some reason his does. And I'm like, God damn it. He, he has all the best people on there, mm-hmm. especially when he had Marshawn Lynch. And I was just like, why are you at commercial again? You were just at commercial 30 seconds ago. And here we are with another fucking ad. I know. You have to so, get like that YouTube pr- premium. Yeah. Fucking oh yeah, shit. that's what it's called, and it's twelve dollars a month. And I'm like, well, it's cheaper than Netflix. Maybe yeah. I'll do it. Yeah, you're <laughs> like, fuck you, Netflix. Bye. I'm gonna fuck. I can't believe twenty. Or I think you told me, and then somebody else on um Twitter was complaining. Raider Nation, of course. They're like, um, Netflix is twenty three dollars a month mm-hmm. now, and I'm like, I canceled Netflix a long time ago, so I don't know. I know. I'm still like I I know I secretly have your code for Hulu, and I'm like, mm, yeah, mm. to do it. Yeah, well, Hulu. Um, but my daughter was so mad in the beginning because I used to sign up for the there. There was two versions of Hulu back in the I don't know, like maybe ten years ago. Um, so I signed up for the version that had no commercials. So it was like, I want to say it was like a hundred dollars more a year. Fuck. Yeah, so I'm like, cool. I don't want fucking commercials. But then they emailed me an offer. They're like, if you want, um, and it was only good for one year. But they're like, if you sign up for um, Hulu with commercials or with ads involved, that's only fifty dollars for the year. And I'm like, sold. <laughs> and we've we've been on um fucking with the ads ever since. And I'm like, it's just obviously regular TV. Wait, can what, you fast you forward the ads? No, you can't. I know that's where. The but gets um. But I'm just like, who cares? And I'm like, it's well. That's know, what when I'm pouring another drink or having a potty break, <laughs> right? <laughs> and plus, I have press. I have um, obviously it's Hulu, so you can um, pause it or whatever if I do need to get up. But um, yeah, I don't even know if they offer uh, without ads anymore. But it's like a, about a hundred dollars for the year. Jesus. So it's not bad. Okay. Well, I haven't used your your code yet, but I I, I just dumped dish network um oh, okay well good yeah, that I'm was kind of like of okay, what type of ads do i want and i'm i'm really doing my research about like do i want paramount plus do i want hulu because i work 6 days a week 
I, I'm right. never fucking home. It's just kind of like that's when how I am. I just kind of so, wind down. And I want to see what I want to see. Um, so I'm trying to figure out what should I really invest in. Uh, just not, use my login. Yeah. Okay. Well, just just know when you see it, like a little. <laughs> it's gonna ask. There's gonna be two users on there when you log in. So just log in as me. Okay. Because it'll be like, are you are you Medusa or Medusa's daughter? Just do Medusa. Yeah, for sure. I haven't I haven't even touched your login though. By the way. Okay. Just, well, just saying. But I I fine. still have it. <laughs> it's it hasn't changed. It's been the same. Oh, you know, login. like you know, hey, we are one. <laughs> right oh shit speaking of watching tv i don't really watch tv at home i watch tv when i'm at work and this fucking last work week was the work week from hell um i'm i don't really want to get into it other than my supervisor got laid off that set me off and then the person the person the person i guess who's taking over for him i guess i don't know if you want to call it that a replacement or whatever yeah whatever she walks in last uh, for the last two weeks. Yeah, she walks in the last uh, this I think it was two weeks ago when for right before they laid them off. She walks in and you know I have those giant headphones for my um, yeah for my yeah I don't do those little earbuds they fucking piss me they just make me mad so I have them on and I can hear what the fuck she's saying because I know she's there and I'm just like God damn it I can't watch fucking TV I have to listen to a podcast today. <laughs> So I have them on, and she's uh, she's talking to um, my coworker. It's only me and um, AJ in the front, right? So me and AJ, and so she's like, AJ, is Emma in training? And she's like, No. Like, Why she got those big headphones on? She's like, Oh, she's listening to our podcast. And I'm like, mm. So yeah, so I hear everything, right? Yeah. So you're out mute. <laughs> I'm yeah. Mute. <laughs> and then so she's like, Hey, um, what are you listening to? And I'm like. A podcast. <laughs> I fucking can't stand this bitch. And she's like, oh, okay, what are you listening to? And I should have fucking said something like just to test her to say, like, nobody likes Joe Rogan unless you're a fucking guy. Especially little, like, when you're younger women, the younger the younger generations, regardless of the gender pronoun, no, they don't like Joe Rogan. So uh, I should have fucking said Joe Rogan just to see what her fucking facial reaction yeah, should have been. Sure. But I'm like, oh, I'm listening to Two Bears in One Cave. Okay. And she's like, what is that? I'm like, oh, it's two comedians. And she's like, oh, okay. <sighs> Whatever. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I, I have to hide our shit sometimes. I'm like, oh, what the fuck did I say? So everyone's like, you're going to podcast? I'm like, yeah. Oh, my. Okay. So speaking of. Yeah. So I do this. Oh, I see what you're saying. But but you hide about that. I, so I hide. Past- I hide. And they're like, what's your link? I'm like, oh. No, yeah. No. Yeah. <laughs> no. You're like, I'll tell you after I leave this. Yeah, <laughs> for sure, bitch. Like, for sure. But this past week, Pomona Bullets. So this past week, I listened to Joe Rogan. He had um his he had a comic on there. His name was Stavros. I don't know what the last name is. He looks like the fat guy from um, Jurassic Park that gets eaten <laughs> by the dinosaur. <laughs> Let's okay. So he looks like that, right? I have tears. <laughs> I have tears rolling down my face, Pomona Bullets. And they're like, what the fuck are you listening to? I'm like, oh, I'm listening to a podcast. They're like, what are you, what are they talking about? I'm like, I can't tell you. I'm going to get in trouble. <laughs> this motherfucker, he's like, hey, Joe. So just imagine the guy f- from Jurassic Park, the fat guy that gets eaten by a dinosaur. He kind of resembles him. He's like, it gets better. He's like, hey, Joe, have you ever fucked a girl that had, that had a BBL? And he's like, uh, No. So he goes into the whole fucking thing. So I'm like, this is be, he's talking about fucking this girl that has a BBL. The What's first a BBL? thing he says is like a, the Brazilian butt lift. So she got oh. the fake butt. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I'm sorry. So he's like, Joe, the first thing is if you hook up with a girl with a BBL, you have to get with her right after it heals. Like don't get with it while it's healing. Don't get with it a year later. Like four months after it heals is the best prime time to be with her. And Joe's like, okay. <laughs> and then he says, yeah, so then I try to fuck. And then he's like, I try to fuck her from the back. So she has this big, you know, the BBL. Yeah. She's got the BBL going on. He's like, I don't have a big dick. So, like, it was really fucking hard to fuck her from the back. <laughs> 
have you heard of a strap on? <laughs> right. So I was just like, that's what prompted me to be like, you know what? Because um, do you use Spotify or you don't use Spotify? I, I girl for your music. I, I I do not. I just do yeah, Apple okay, no, that's Apple fine. music. No, that's fine. That's fine. So on Spotify, excuse me, because Joe Rogan is now on Spotify exclusively. So if um if you um have Spotify or you use Spotify, you have the option just to listen, or you can like if you have your phone on or like the screen is on, you can watch the actual video because it's video. Oh shit! My podcast. son does that. My son. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Has Spotify. I, I I and I let him because he's a music genius and just like, do you like I was I yeah. I don't know, but I, I'm just like, I'm that old fucking grumpy ass bitch. That just doesn't, I don't fucking have anything. <laughs> okay, well, but then I always You're reach right. out. I'm like, Hey, bestie, do you have Instagram? Oh, Hey son, send me that. <laughs> right. Well, that's how I send you the links or whatever. But, um, so that's what prompted me to like, cause I wasn't watching the, I wasn't watching the podcast. I was only listening. And I have fucking tears rolling down my face. I'm like, who the fuck is this guy? I'm like, I've never heard of this comic before. I need to see what this motherfucker looks like. If he's talking about, he has a tiny dick and he, he has problems fucking <laughs> a girl from behind with the BBL. I look at the fucking video. I'm like, Oh God, he looks like the guy from Jurassic Park. <laughs> no. Wow. And then, and then the other thing that had me fucking crying at work, he's like, Joe, you ever been with a girl that squirted? <laughs> Joe's like, no. So he's like, he's like, well, I have. And Joe's like, okay, are you going to, you know, he asked him to tell him about it. And he's like, yeah, um, it was the most weird experience ever. Like she fucking squirted and it was the most rancid fucking smell. <laughs> <gasps> okay, wait, let's pause on that because like. I squirt and I, th- I I used to think it was piss. I was like, is it piss? No, like, I-, I honestly think it's, I guess they're scientific. The guy or the, the comic Stavros, whatever his last name says, there's scientific research that says, I guess, squirting is an actual thing if it's clear. Yeah. And I'm like, and it actually, I, I don't it doesn't know. come because I, I legit go on the toilet and I push all the piss out. And then it's just like, where is this coming from? <laughs> like, <laughs> I well, say I've never squirted. So, I mean, I guess I haven't. Well, I, just I can't, I can't be so. like, I can't like aim it in a cup or anything. I, I just, right. I, I mean, because just, we're not a guy. Yeah. I just kind of like, what the <laughs> fuck? Did I just piss myself? Like, I don't, I don't fucking know what's going on. And I, I put like, like a shower curtain. I just, you know, okay, let's just, well, we're all oiled up. We might as well do it. Okay, so you know what? I just remembered. So remember that one time I went to your place and we were hanging out and I was fucking drunk. And then I'm like, hey, I think I texted you or, or what? Remember when the tattoo shop, um, my tattoo guy yeah. was yeah. right up the street from you? Yeah. I don't know if Vita I ever Loka. told you. I yeah. think I told you this. Maybe I told you this. But like after your place, I hit his place up because I would hang out with him just to fucking hang out, right? Yep. Did I tell you that we fucked that one Yes, day? you did. I was like, you fucking <laughs> bitch. I was so fucking jealous. I was fucking I was like, you're getting some dick and I can't. Like, damn. (laughs) You're fucking fucking just making pancakes with me. (laughs) Did I tell you I I pissed on the floor? You you did. I was like, maybe it's not piss. Oh, did I tell you that? Yeah, you're just like. Oh, okay. But I I was like, maybe you squirted. Like, who knows? Or or maybe he hit the bladder and it. I just freaked. Who knows? I don't know. I just remember um, because we were going at it, and I'm like, hey, I really have to, we got to stop. I got to go to the bathroom. He's like, no, you don't. I'm like, yes, I fucking do. And he's like, no, you don't. I'm like, oh, maybe I don't, right? So we get fucking done. (laughs) Mr. T. I I fucking, I'm not going to say his name, but Jesus, I used to, I used to fucking kind of hate you. (laughs) You come over to make breakfast with me, and we're drinking. And we're, we're making and beer we're that one time. And then you're like, bye, bitch. And then I'm like, oh, man. And oh. so um, all I remember is like, we get done. And I'm just like, I'm um, putting my shoes or my slippers back or my sandals back on. I'm like, what the fuck? I'm like, why is the floor wet? And he's like, what? He's like, what the fuck? The floor's wet. And and then we fucking really, he's like, oh, remember when you said you had to pee? And I'm like, fuck. <laughs> you're crying. like nah bitch that wasn't pee that was that was Kyle's that sounds like squirt <laughs> squirt 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 <laughs> <laughs> fucking no 
I don't know. So, promotable. If he's like, hey, was um peeing during sex ever on your um on your fucking bucket list? I'm like, no. Was it on yours? He's like, no. I'm like, he's like, how about we write it in and like check it off right away? I'm like, high five, bro. Oh, <laughs> he was fucking amazing. I can't believe you fucked him. I wanted to fuck him, but you got him first. <laughs> no, you could have fucked him. I don't care. I didn't put dibs or I didn't put a like claim on that. You could have fucking hit nah. that. You can have him. <laughs> I'm not going to mop up my squirt. <laughs> <Shit>. <laughs> Okay, that's the sound bite we need to use for the intro. <laughs> Damn, I've known um I've known him since uh 1990. Yeah. Way yeah. back. Like honestly, great guy. He used to be like a classic it. tattoo. I want to I don't even know if classic tattoo is still in Upland. No, it's not. Huh. Like a fucking mattress. Remember that mattress company just kind of Yeah, over? and Annie's hubcap. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Shit. Uh, I wonder if Annie's hubcaps is still there. Probably not. It's probably just a fucking. I, I, I'm not gonna. I, I, you know what? I'm going to just not say nothing. <laughs> <laughs> it's probably all mattresses. <sighs> there you go. Because that's all the 909 is good for. Uh, yeah. Money and laundry, but it's all good. <laughs> I'm gonna sneak that in there. Okay, do you have any other rants? Oh, girl, please. We would go on and on, on and for on. days so and we years. Are right. going to, yeah, my rants are just, I am just super excited that we're finally getting back on our like groove. We're going to do our Sundays. Yes. To everybody who wants to listen, we miss everybody and we thank you. Um, but I'm good. Yeah, I'm good too. I think we should set some 2024 goals for the podcast. Oh, there's got to be. I, you know how like your daughter G Unit said you guys should do a video podcast. So it's just like how we would be in front of our computers the way um, Unc Shannon Sharp yeah. and Chad Ocho Cinco is. That would be cool if we could do it that way. But um, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. If I, you're I, up mean, for I that. think it would be nice if uh, they could all see our 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 mugs. our faces, <laughs> or you know. We could pretend we're shots. still in quarantine, and um, you could put a mask on if you don't want to, like, be all showing your face. You could put a Wait, mask on. Wait, but I have some fucking... My grill is, like, legit. Right? You could wear your wig! Yeah, yes! I can yes. wear your wig! You can wear your fucking wig! Okay, so uh, 2024 goals, um, listeners, we're going to get Pomona Bullets to be online in person because she doesn't want to have a social, or an online social presence. Which Sorry, totally guys. Get. Sorry. Yeah. But that's no, that's that's your thing. I respect it. But you know, if you have that fucking wig, you can put some glasses on, and we could totally for fucking do show. this shit. For sure, it's like so. You yeah. bought that wig, and we're gonna put it to fucking use. We will dust that bitch off. <laughs> for sure, I love you guys. All right, guys. everybody who's listening, thank you. That's right. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so have a good week, everybody, and we will. See you next week, next Sunday. Yes, listen to us next week, please. That's right. (laughs) Bye. Bye.